In Jerusalem, the first week in February was sunny and it felt like spring. The flow of pilgrims visiting the sanctuaries included a group of collaborators of the Holy See, led by His Excellency Monsignor Piero Marini, who has a long and special connection with the Holy Land. Faith teaches us these interconnections, the relationships of the Gospel. Every believer has a different connection with these places. Since I was a master of celebrations, I have always organized trips to rediscover our faith. Sometimes it is necessary to return to the sources of one's faith. Every occasion is new to find new aspects, to discover different places and new sensations. Every time you come to the land of the Lord, you discover something new. Here, everything speaks. Each pilgrim brings his life story that leads them to live and experience with the Holy Land. I associate it with the celebration. We, during the liturgical year, celebrate the mysteries of Christ, which took place in these places. It is great to re-experience these celebrated mysteries in those places where they took place. That is why I like to call these celebrations singing pilgrimages. Another aspect that requires attention are variations in the forms of expression of faith. I would like to emphasize the ecumenism that we experience here, the presence of so many peoples who believe in Christ, whose faith has slight variations in Christ. For me, it is a real joy and it increases my faith. Visiting the Holy Land is always a very special experience for those who come here for the first time and for those who return. A very intense experience. It allows you to retrace the most important events in Christ's life. We hope to return. I worked 20 years in the Propaganda Fide. Seeing that faith has truly been propagated is a joy. It was truly a gift to come to the Holy Land. This is my first time here. I'm a professor of Christology at St. Anselm. My experience here is seeing faith and having a true connection with it. On my return to Rome, I will explain to my students how man really welcomes God and how God welcomes man. This is my experience. Coming to Jerusalem and returning to the Holy Land as always means returning to the roots of faith. Furthermore, Jerusalem is always an extraordinary experience. In this place, there is an overlap of faith and overlap of peoples. It gives us hope for the future. El futuro. Monsignor Piero Marini was a master of papal liturgical celebrations from 1987 to 2007. 18 years working alongside Pope John Paul II. There are several indelible events, in particular the journey to the Holy Land during the Great Jubilee in 2000. There are some recordi that non si possono cancellare. One of the recordi più belli è stato quella della messa celebrata nel cenacolo. Some memories are unforgettable. One of the most beautiful memories was that of the Mass celebrated in the Cynical. I also remember the gesture of John Paul II when he placed his note in the Wailing Wall. I recall the celebration in the square in Bethlehem which witnessed a great public participation. These are the memories that come to my mind right now. It was a truly rich and important journey also for my life of faith, which taught me a lot. I will certainly come back. Un viaggio veramente eh, ricco e importante anche per la mia vita di fede che mi ha insegnato molto. Certamente ritornerò.